Davian Howard forced the fumble and returned it for a touchdown. Jacoby Brissett left with a knee injury. Tua Tungabailoa, who didn't start because of a fractured finger, forced into action and led the Dolphins to a 22-10 win over the Ravens on Thursday night. Elsewhere, Odell Beckham Jr. has agreed to a one-year contract with the Rams worth up to $4.25 million. Beckham, released by the Browns, became a free agent when he cleared waivers on Tuesday. OBJ, welcome to L.A. by Lakers superstar LeBron James, who tweeted, quote, Welcome to L.A., my brother. It's go time. Plus, Cam Newton is back with the Panthers, returning to the team he helped reach the Super Bowl in 2015. The deal worth up to $10 million for the remainder of the season. Carolina adding some QB depth after Sam Darnold suffered a shoulder injury Sunday that will sideline him for four to six weeks. This has been NFL Network Now on the Westwood One Radio Network. Hey, I'm Andy. If you don't know me, it's probably because I'm not famous. But I did start a men's grooming company called Harry's. The idea for Harry's came out of a frustrating experience I had buying razor blades. Most brands were overpriced, overdesigned, and out of touch. At Harry's, our approach is simple. Here's our secret. We make sharp, durable blades and sell them at honest prices for as low as $2 each. We care about quality so much that we do some crazy things, like buy a world-class German blade factory. Obsessing over every detail means we're confident in offering a 100% quality guarantee. Millions of guys have already made the switch to Harry's, so thank you if you're one of them. And if you're not, we hope you give us a try with this special offer. Get a Harry starter set with a five-blade razor, weighted handle, shave gel, and a travel cover. All for just three bucks, plus free shipping. Just go to harrys.com and enter 6680 at checkout. That's harrys.com, code 6680. Enjoy. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Uh, why is your name not Harry? Uh, I always wondered that. Uh, we are the Imperial Valleys, AM 1230 KXO, El Centro, California. Good day, sunshine. It's a beautiful Friday morning. Yeah, the uh, 12th day of November, 2021. I got it right. And, uh, well, just a reminder, the uh, Mobile Vietnam Memorial Wall at Buckland Park through Monday morning. So uh, you have an opportunity to uh, visit and uh, reflect and maybe get some information from some of the uh, veterans that are there. Uh, <coughs> Gene, we're, we're, we are coming up, let's see, um, a little bit later this morning. Sorry we, about that. Yeah, yeah I got well, all choked it, up this morning. Yes, I know you choked up because uh, Captain William Perkins will be here about 8.30 this morning. Going to visit with us, which we're looking forward to. Yes, the skipper of NAFL Centro, and we'll get an update as to what's going on there. At least those of us that have the proper clearances will find out. Well, yeah. He's, he's going to come and, and visit with you, right? Yes, yes. But then I have a top secret NAC and crypto clearance. Not everybody has them. Yeah, you've got one of those Dick Tracy uh, watches, too, yes. which nobody probably knows what we're talking about. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Coming up in the news, we'll talk about another fire in El Centro. And, uh, well, uh, we'll just let... Let it, you know about that, suspicious. as well as a few other things that are going on around the valley, right? Yeah, it's cattle call weekend. I mean, don't say there is nothing to do in Imperial Valley. There's nothing to do in the Imperial Valley. Nobody believes you. Yeah, I think I'll go out in a ditch bank, hide behind a stack of hay and drink beer. Yeah. Yeah, you never did that, did you? Never did, absolutely. Yeah. Okay. Uh, how about some big shot birthdays today? All right. Big shot. Yes. Playwright, actor Wallace Shawn is 78. Singer Brian Hyland. Itsy bitsy teeny weeny yellow polka dot bikini sealed with a kiss. He's 78. Booker T. Jones. Guess what group Booker T. Jones is with? The MGs. Yes. Booker T. and the MGs. Uh, sportscaster Al Michaels, 77. Neil Young is 76. Maybe he ought to be Neil Old now. Eh? Yeah. He's a Canadian. Yeah. Guitarist Buck Dharma of Blue Oyster Cult, your favorite group, 74. 
Actor Megan Mullally is 63. Uh, David Ellefson of Megadeth, your second favorite group, is 57. Actor Rebecca Wisaki is 50. Actor Rada Mitchell is 48. Actor Tamala Jones, 47. Actor Angela Watson, 47. Singer Tevin Campbell, 45. Actor Ashley Williams is 43. Actor Cote de Pablo is 42. Actor Ryan Gosling is 41. And uh, we do have some uh, local birthdays. You want to hear them? I, I would like to hear them, please. Here, here we go. We have happy birthday with Albert Ramirez, Kevin Kaiser, Samantha Negrete, Doug Strain, Shelby King, Benito Chavez, Rachel Felix, Christy Montgomery, Felicitas Gonzalez, Tony Lau, Alexis Mesa, Kelly Jackson, Michaela Gady, Jeanette Escobedo. Victor Godoy, Erica Torres, Leigh Lani, Roberta Salica, Maria Gale, Nancy Thornburg, Rosie Morales, and Jesse Dominguez. Happy birthday from KXO. Okay. Birthday wishes to all of them. And just to uh, give you a heads up, we will not, I say again, we will not be broadcasting uh, high school football tonight. We will not have the uh, Holtville Calexico game. We will not have the Central Scripps Ranch game. But we will have a scoreboard on our website, and uh, you can keep up with uh, the scores. And we have Kurt Hoffman, and nobody can say that. Well, nobody wants to say that. <laughs> we have Kurt Hoffman. Yeah. Yeah, No, nobody... Nobody else would take him, you know, when it came time to pick teams. He was always the last one chosen, right? Give, him, give it to Mikey. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Somehow that name doesn't, uh, doesn't fit with his physical stouch stature. No, not at all. Oh, well. Anyway, and um, let's see. We mentioned the Vietnam Memorial Wall. You mentioned uh, Cattle Call, uh, the rodeo. Two performances tomorrow, one on Sunday. But we'll tell you about that coming up in news, right? Right. Are you going to be riding one of the Bronx? Uh, no. No? No. <laughs> Younger, dumber, and uh, filled with liquor, right? Probably in that order. Yes. Okay. Uh, that's something, again, I grew up in a big city. I did not grow up around horses or cows or any of that. So, um, But now the big city comes uh, to the rodeo. Yes. Yes. I People know. that never yeah. wear a hat except one time a year. You maybe, got it. Maybe two. Yes. And, uh, you know, about the closest I got to a horse was uh, there was a Shetland pony at uh, a local dairy. Mm -hmm. And uh, the uh, um, in the summer, a produce guy with a wagon hauled by a horse would come through the neighborhood. And so you rode it and it bit you. Well, the Shetland bit me. Mm -hmm. Yes. Me and little boogers. Okay. And they have been known to do that. <laughs> yes. Okay, we've got news. Are you ready? I'm ready. Uh, it's World in California News Headlines right now, brought to you by Lock Air Conditioning. They are your year-round comfort specialist for sales for service. Call the experts at Lock Air Conditioning. CBS News Brief. Less than two weeks before Thanksgiving, COVID cases are rising in 35 states. Dr. Michelle Barron at University of Colorado Health. I think we had this magical number in our heads that, oh, once we reach X amount of vaccination, we're good. And clearly that's not the case. Just in, Americans quit their jobs at a record pace for the second month in a row. Parents in Seattle School District got last-minute notice classes would be canceled today because of staffing shortages. If they could give us a heads up a little earlier, that would be so much easier for the parents. It needs to be a little bit better communicated and better planned. Schools say many teachers are suffering burnout and there aren't enough subs to go around. Travis Scott spokeswoman Stephanie Rawlings-Blake is speaking out after a ninth person died as a result of a crowd surge at the rapper's concert a week ago. She tells CBS. Someone has to say, where are the breakdowns? Where was the communication breakdown? Where was the public safety breakdown? CBS News Brief. I'm Deborah Rodriguez. 
Become a Lock Air Conditioning VIP customer and get special pricing on cooling and heating tune-ups all year long. Call today to become a Lock Air Conditioning VIP customer at 760-93-L-O-C-K-E. That's 760-93-L-O-C-K-E. Lock VIPs receive discounted service and maintenance, discounted repairs, and priority service with prompt service. Lock Air Conditioning is your local York dealer, but they repair it all. So when the need arises, don't hesitate to call Lock Air Conditioning at 760-93-L-O-C-K-E. That's 76093 L O C K E. Lock, the only name in air conditioning for over 40 years. York, install with confidence. Contractor's license number 696216. California Headline News marchers gather near the Golden Gate Bridge to rally against vaccine mandates. I don't want people to be forced to put anything in their bodies. I'm here because there are a lot of black people whose voices are silent in this fight. A lot of black people who will be unemployed. The protest taking a dangerous turn when an SUV collided with a street sweeper, pushing it into a line of CHP officers who were patrolling the area. A total of five people hurt, including at least two of the officers. Movie and TV production workers today, considering whether to approve a tentative contract agreement or reject it and go out on strike. Union members wanting fundamental changes to the industry. Incremental changes won't fix fundamental problems. We are here to impress upon you why the need is for fundamental change. Member Victor Boozy, an infant safely recovered in the Placer County community of Auburn after the child was left alone in a car, two suspects hopping in and stealing it, a pursuit ending when the car crashed into a utility pole, the infant and two suspects hospitalized. Jeff Scott, California News. World in California News Headlines brought to you this morning by Lock Air Conditioning, your year-round comfort specialist. For sales, for service, call the experts, Lock Air Conditioning and Custom Sheet Metal. Black Friday's here at JCPenney, and so are even more new Black Friday deals this Friday through Sunday. The new Champion Apparel for the family, up to 40% off. Plus, find a little extra sparkle in your savings with up to 75% off signed jewelry. These deals and more end Sunday. Happy Black Friday, JCPenney. Offers valid on select items 11-12 through 11-14. Exclusion supply. Champion excluded from coupons. See store or jcp.com for details. Well, I started my own restaurant because I love to cook. But that also means a lot of greasy pots and pans. And we can't waste time with endless sink changeovers. So we upgraded to Dawn Professional Pot and Pan. Dawn Professional cleans 58% more pots and pans per sink than the leading competitor. Less dish soap, fewer changeovers, and more time doing what we love. Dawn Professional. It's clean. Upgraded. From p g Professional. It's page one of the local news. Page one is service of Quick Lane Tire and Auto Centers in Brawley and Del Centro. Quick Lane, they service all makes and all models, and you never need an appointment. It's in local news for a Friday morning. Active cases of COVID-19. The numbers are in. George Gale has the story. They have gone down a little. Latest numbers were released by the County Public Health Department. They indicate the number of active cases of COVID-19 in Imperial County are at 418. That's down from the 435 active cases reported on Tuesday. Deaths attributed to the virus remain at 760. There are 44 COVID patients lost in the county. 14 are in intensive care. There are 578 Delta variant cases in the county since the variant was first encountered in the county. State care metrics for Imperial County indicate a positivity rate, seven-day average, is at 9.4%. New cases per day per 100 population is at 24.10. Total vaccine doses administered in Imperial County are at over 283,000. For local News, I'm George Gale. In continuance with the local news, an El Centro resident reported that they had been scammed. The resident told police that there were victims rental scam. Apparently, the resident found a house for rent on Craigslist and sent the $2,300 deposit for the house uh, by uh, Zelly app. The supposed owner of the property then disappeared and hasn't responded to any text messages. KXO News Time, coming up to 743.
Quick Lane Tire and Auto Centers have the best price on name brand tires sold at Quick Lane, guaranteed. Just ask your Quick Lane service advisor. Now we're talking the best brands available, Michelin, Continental, Pirelli, Dunlap, Kelly, Bridgestone, and more. And we're talking the best price. Quick Lane Tire and Auto Centers, they service all makes and all models, and you never need an appointment. Quick Lane, in the Broly Auto Center, Highway 86 in Julia Drive, and on Imperial Avenue next to Food for Less in El Centro. In other local news, uh, Brawley's main event is uh, here, really. I was going to say around the corner. George Gale has the story. Cattle Call Weekend starts tomorrow. The uh, traditional Cattle Call Parade starts at 9 a.m. on Friday. The uh, parade route is still down Main Street west to east. After the parade, everything shifts to the Cattle Call Arena. 65th Annual Cattle Call Rodeo will feature two performances on Saturday. Mutton busting returns for the rodeo uh, to the rodeo for the kids. Also for the kids, there will be a Cattle Call Dollar Dig, which is a type of treasure hunt. On Sunday, there will be one rodeo performance, but Sunday is also family day uh, with a free pony rides, a face painting, a roping exhibition, and more. Gates open at noon on Saturday at 11 a.m. on Sunday. Tickets are available at the gate both days. For KXO Local News, I'm George Gale. And that will conclude this edition of Local News. With us for page two. Patron of the local news, the service of Quick Lane Tire and Auto Centers in Brawley and Del Centro. Quick Lane, they service all makes and all models, and you never need an appointment. At Burgers and Beer, we want you to be happy. Live happy. <laughs> work happy. Most of all, we want you to celebrate whatever makes you happy at Burgers and Beer. Bring your friends, bring your family, and let's make time for a good time. All the drinks, all the food, and great service, too. Everything you need is right here at Burgers and Beer. Burgers and Beer, the best burgers in town. Page two of the local news and weather brought to you by David H. West Insurance Services. See David or Jose, because they've got answers to your questions about Medicare supplemental coverage. David H. West Insurance Services. Several road closures have been uh, reported. Here's more on that story. Davis Road from Highway 111 to Beach Road is closed. This closure is due to a sinkhole. Public Works says the sinkhole was caused by a damaged drain pipe. Closure will be, remain in effect until repairs are finished. Mud Road is uh, closed from Forrester Road to Sweet Road due to a damaged bridge deck. It will remain closed until further notice. In El Centro, 8th Street between Horn Road and Dannenberg Road will be closed to north and southbound traffic beginning Monday, November 15th, for maintenance work on the city's water distribution system. Work is expected to be completed by 5 p.m. Friday, November 19th. Detour signs will be posted. For KXO Local News, I'm George Gale. In other local news, uh, fire this morning. Uh, Carol Buckley has more on this story. At about quarter till three this morning, El Central Fire Department responded to a fire in a single-story multifamily building in the 600 block of Commercial Avenue in the city and uh, immediately called in mutual aid resources from the city of Holtville, city of Calexico, city of Imperial, and county of Imperial responded as... Uh, the uh, firefighters battled the blaze. A attack on the fire confined uh, that blaze to the apartment unit involved, preventing the spread to uh, three other apartments. The fire controlled within 20 minutes of arrival. Firefighters remained on the scene uh, for over three hours looking for hidden signs of fire in the building. Seven residents were displaced. They're being assisted by the American Red Cross. Two residents uh, of the building were injured and uh, taken to a local hospital for treatment. The fire has been classified as accidental in nature. In other local news, a memorial bridge dedication ceremony will take place uh, later this morning. George Gale explains. 
It will be held this morning. The ceremony will take place to officially commemorate and unveil the sign renaming the Alamo River Bridge on the Evan Hughes Highway at the entry to Tahoeville as the Marine Corporal Eric H. Silva Memorial Bridge. Corporal Silva grew up in Hoteville. He was killed in the Iraq War in 2003. Ceremony is the culmination of a long, tireless effort from the uh, Silva family, veterans groups, and community members. Attending the ceremony will be members of the corporal's family. For more information on these and other local news stories, go to the KXL website. For KXL Local News, I'm George Gale. We'll be back with a look at the weather. Have you received notice that your Medicare health plan is changing or going away? Are you turning 65 soon or are you newly eligible to Medicare and have questions about your Medicare options? Then give David or Jose a call at David H. West Insurance to learn about the ABCs of Medicare. Don't delay. Call David H. West Insurance Services now at 760-352-3411. That's 760-352-3411. That's David H. West Insurance. Here's Carol Buckley with the weather update. The National Weather Service says high pressure over the region will persist through early next week, resulting in continued dry conditions and above normal temperatures across the Imperial and Yuma Valleys. A cooling trend is then anticipated early next week as the area of high pressure weakens. No rain is expected through at least late next week. 89 are high yesterday, 56 the low. Sunny today with a high near 90. West-northwest wind 5 to 10 miles an hour becoming north-northeast. Mostly clear tonight with a low around 60. West-northwest wind about 5 miles an hour. Saturday will be sunny with a high near 89. West-northwest wind about 5 miles an hour becoming north-northeast in the afternoon. Sunday sunny with a high near 89. North-northwest wind about 5 miles an hour. 66 degrees downtown, 46 percent and relative humidity wind out of the west at three miles an hour air quality throughout the valley and mexicali is good page two of the local news brought to you by david h west insurance services see david or jose for life insurance health insurance and medicare supplemental coverage and see the peanut patch for absolutely delightful chocolates yes the peanut patch in yuma many homemade chocolates delicious and gluffy. Yeah, they're made right there. Pecan turtles made from a special recipe. They make them from scratch at the peanut patch. Ah, yes, you'll love their yogurt-covered peanuts, raisins, and almonds. It's the peanut patch in Yuma. Yeah, uh, you want directions? Well, I would suggest you Google peanutpatch.com. Thepeanutpatch.com, and uh, you'll get directions. You'll get an idea of what they have to offer. It's a great place to uh, stop by and visit and shop for the holidays. Remember, they ship worldwide. The Peanut Patch in Yuma. It's sports time. Sports time brought to you this morning by Pioneers Memorial Healthcare District, an affiliate of the Scripps Health Network, working together to provide you the best care. Thursday night football, the uh, Dolphins came roaring back in the fourth quarter. They beat the Ravens 22-10. Yeah, the Dolphins with a big win over the heavily favored Ravens. Meanwhile, Odell Beckham Jr. has agreed to a one-year contract with the Los Angeles Rams. Okay, is he going to make it through a whole year? Yeah, we'll, uh, we'll see. Yeah, and he joins uh, Matthew Stafford at uh, QB. And, uh, well... The wide receivers, Cooper Cup, Robert Woods, Van Jefferson. There's only one football. Odell's daddy's going to get mad when he doesn't get it often enough. Meanwhile, Cam Newton has signed a deal to rejoin the Carolina Panthers. And in Washington, Seahawks quarterback Russell Wilson sidelined uh, uh, for uh, several weeks. Should be back in action this Sunday. 
Pioneers Memorial Healthcare District, ready to serve you and your family for all your health care needs. Let our team of dedicated physicians guide you on your journey to better health. Pioneers is a recognized leader in health care and has more than 10 health centers and clinics throughout the Imperial Valley. When the need arises, don't hesitate to come and see us. We have services and locations in Calexico and Brawley and, of course, our award-winning hospital, Pioneers Memorial. For more information on all of Pioneers services, visit pmhd.org today. NBA action, the Raptors rolled. They topped the 76ers, 115-109. Pacers beat up on the Jazz, 111-100. Clippers, uh, they uh, got by the Heat, 112-109. Four players were ejected, Rudy Gobert and Miles Turner into a late in the Pacers victory over the Utah Jazz. So began after Gobert appeared to pull Turner down to the ground after Turner blocked his shot at the rim with just over four minutes left to play. Meanwhile, in other news, Bernhard Langer and uh, Phil Mickelson are playing well. It's uh, Mickelson and Lied for the lead the Schwab Cup in Phoenix. High school football and uh, tonight, it's uh, the Brawley Wildcats on the road. They will take on the Eagles of Christian tonight. Palo Verde will host the Crawford Colts. Wow. It'll be the Vision 5 uh, round matchup. Calexico Hill in the Carrot Capital. The Central Spartans on the road. They will be at Scranch. In San Diego, second round CIF football. We will not, again, will not be able to broadcast the Calexico game or the Central and uh, Scripps Ranch game. We will have the scores posted, uh, updated uh, continuously on our site, texoradio.com. Sports time brought to you this morning by Pioneers Memorial. Log on to pmhd.org for more information about Pioneer Healthcare History. Thank you for choosing Imperial Printers Rocket Copy. In today's highly competitive business climate, your company's image is important. The printed materials your company uses conveys a major part of that image. Our graphic designers have the talent and expertise to create a lasting impression for your business. Imperial Printers Rocket Copy offers virtually any type of business solution to meet your needs. Business cards and stationery to computer forms, full color brochures and posters. Let our excellent service and attention to detail provide the best impression for you. Locally owned and operated, Imperial Printers Rocket Copy has locations near you at 430 West Main Street and 100 South 11th Street in El Centro and 184 South Plaza in Brawley. Financial news and a brief look at the weather. Well, it is brought to you this morning by Southwest Security. Southwest Security is offering 24-hour-a-day post office boxes at Southwest Postal at the corner of 4th and Heil in El Centro. Well, a record number, 4.4 million Americans quit their jobs in September as the sheer volume of available jobs is empowering workers to have their pick. Jobs particularly increased in the healthcare sector and in state and local government. Employers hired 6.5 million people, while separations, which include voluntary quits, stood at 6.2 million. Meanwhile, AstraZeneca has booked its first profit from sales of its COVID-19 vaccine. The company sold $2.2 billion worth of the shot in the first nine months of the year. In the quarter ending September 30th, vaccine sales totaled $1.05 billion, contributing one cent to earnings per share. Announcing uh, the earnings today, the UK's largest pharmaceutical company said it expected to see modest profits from the vaccine in the final quarter of this year. 
as it gave guidance on the sales impact of its COVID-19 vaccine for the very first time. Inflation, well, it's still on the rise. Prices uh, on beef, eggs, bacon up nearly 30% since uh, last October. On the big board, green, partially. Dow Jones Industrials up 46 points at 35,967. The S&P 500 up 12 at 46,61. The NASDAQ up 59 points at 15,763. Gold off 40 cents an ounce. Whoopee, oil down 91 cents a barrel. You're going to see that change at the pump any minute now. Count on it. Southwest Security Company is a locally owned security company protecting your property or your business and now offering live scan fingerprinting to the public. Plus, they added Southwest Postal with post office boxes you can access 24 hours a day, 365 days, with shipping services too, using DHL, UPS, and FedEx. They're conveniently located at the corner of Hyle and 4th Street in El Centro. And if you need something notarized, they can do that too. You can count on Southwest Security and Southwest Postal for 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. We will have sunny skies to high near 90, west northwest wind 5 to 10, now north northeast. Tonight will be mostly clear with a low around 60, south southeast wind 5 miles an hour becoming north northwest. Sunny on with a high 9, south wind around 5 miles an hour, becoming north in the afternoon. And we have 66 degrees, 45% relativity, wind out of the west at 3 miles an hour. Air quality throughout the Imperial and the Mexicali Valleys right now, air quality is good. Enjoy. Financial news and the weather brought to you by Southwest Security Services, offering live scan fingerprinting to the public. Roto-Rooter, your plumbing and drain cleaning specialist. Roto-Rooter offers full services from hydro jetting to camera inspection, water heaters, faucets, garbage disposals, any logged up. They'll take care of the problem right. Roto-Rooter is a locally owned family business with 56 years in the Imperial Valley. Call the experts at 7 or 344-2533 on the north end. Roto-Rooter, when drains don't work, we do. The KXO. Well, Central, the Imperial News Source. This is CBS News on the Hour, sponsored by Eggland's Best. I'm Steve. COVID-19 cases have been trending higher for the past two weeks. CBS's Mola Lenghi says ICUs in Colorado are running at 95%. Bigger has signed an executive order declaring Colorado a high-risk COVID state. That order makes all adults here, all of them. COVID back. Michelle Barron says most of those hospitalized in Colorado are unvaccinated. So it's been a high percentage of individuals vaccinated above the national average, but that means that the people are still vaccinated in the setting of the Delta variant means they're vulnerable. A Louisiana board has just voted in favor of a position for Homer Plessy. He was the man of the center of the Plessy versus Ferguson in the late 1800s. The separate but ruling. Is arousing to leave a whites only train car. Final decision up to the governor. The ninth person in the Houston concert desert is at the chain felt those who were in the crush. The performer, Travis Scott, has been named in dozens of lawsuits. But his spokeswoman, Stephanie Rawlings Blake, tells CBS Mornings he can't be blamed for not stopping so sooner. This notion that Travis had the ability to stop the concert is ludicrous. They have a 59-page uh, operations plan, and it clearly says the only uh, two people that are um, have the authority to stop the concert were the executive produ concert producer. Final wording is being worked out on a global close out the two-week global climate summit in Scotland. John Kerry is ending the United States. I think the language is coming together. I really feel very confident. We are we're going to raise the amount of money for adaptation. We're going to be moving in the right direction. Futterman Dave to be the final chapter in the saga of the Britney Spears conservator. There's no opposition right now. Britney Spears has asked for it to end. Her father, who's come under attack for the way he handled the leadership, he now agreed to come to an end. It's now 
the, and really it would be a big surprise if by the end of the day this arrangement isn't ended. A dolphin named Winter with a prosthetic tail that was the centerpiece of the tail to die. Dr. Buddy Powell says she had an engine that was too much to overcome. Devastated. The world is so sad to have an animal in that inspired us all and her leg continued to live on. Wall Street right now, the Dow is up one hundred points. This is CBS News. Tinder nutrition and taste are more important than ever. That's why Eggland's Best gives you and your family more. And that's healthy news for everyone. Only Eggland's. Your parents reached for Vicks when you were little. Now now the Vicks Children's Botanicals Cough Syrup is what you reach for to help soothe coughs and clear mucus without drugs or high fructose corn syrup. That's because it contains natural marshmallow root and ivy leaf to help soothe coughs and clear mucus associated with hoarseness, dryness, and irritants. So look for Vicks Children's Botanicals Cough Syrup, day or night formula. These statements have not been evaluated by the Food and Drug Administration. This product is not intended to diagnose, treat, cure, or prevent any disease. Dell's Black Friday event has arrived, and it's the perfect time to step up your creativity. With early access savings up to $300 off PCs, it's Dell's biggest sale of the year. Get more into what you're into with the latest XPS and Alienware systems featuring Intel Core processors. Save on top monitors, docks, and accessories, all with free shipping, plus great financing from Dell Preferred Account. Call 800 by dell for Black Friday deals. That's 800 by dell <laughs> A rough start today for some air travelers on the East Coast. An early morning power outage in the main terminal at Raleigh International Airport led to flight delays, cancellations, long lines, and frustration. The power outage left E. Vargas feeling powerless. I was trying to get to New York, got here at uh, 4 o'clock in the morning. My flight was leaving at 520 to find all of this chaos going on. Some flights to RDU had to be diverted to other airports. It's not clear what caused the power outage. Jim Chrysula, CBS News. A former top aide to Britain's Prince Charles has quit as a chief executive of the heir to the throne's charitable foundation. This comes after allegations that Michael Fawcett offered to help a wealthy Saudi businessman secure a knighthood and British citizenship in exchange for a big donation. The businessman has denied any wrongdoing. I'm Steve Kafin, CBS News. I'm CBS News business analyst Jill Schlesinger. Dealing with car repairs can feel like a lose-lose situation. You lose your money and your time. And if you don't have the right coverage, just one repair could bleed you dry. If you call CarShield, you won't be worried about expensive repairs anymore. CarShield administrators handle the paperwork and expensive payments, so you don't have to. It's a win-win. Seriously, CarShield could save you thousands. You get to pick your favorite mechanic to do the work, and CarShield administrators take care of the rest. It's like they're your own personal team of auto repair problem solvers. Plans from CarShield even provide roadside assistance, rental coverage, and trip reimbursement, all at no additional charge. Whether your car has 5,000 miles or 150,000 miles, CarShield has monthly options to fit your budget. Get coverage today and see why CarShield cars go farther. Visit carshield.com slash jill to save 10%. That's carshield.com slash Jill. A deductible may apply. And now, more of the best oldies on the radio with Carol Buckley. 1230 AM. 